in the first three quarters of this year alone, three quarters, the railroad industry made $21 billion in profit, record-breaking profits. They gave in the last year $25 billion in stock buybacks to the wealthy shareholders. And yet you have workers all over this country who work for the railroads, people who are working at dangerous jobs and inclement weather, have zero paid sick leave. That is outrageous. And I think it's incumbent upon Congress to do everything that it can to protect these workers, to make sure that the railroad starts treating them with the respect and the dignity that they deserve. I would much prefer us not to intervene, um, but at the same time, for this to shut down uh, will be horrendous for Kansas as well as for Kansas agriculture. So uh, I think all the cards are on the table right now. I haven't decided what I'll do. Well, I think it's a national security issue, whether it's supply chain issues, whether it's the type of material that they uh, transport. It's the security of our nation, our economic uh, security as well as our, our health security. So yes, I think this is an urgent issue and Congress needs to step up. Uh, we don't like to do this. We'd rather see the parties do it through labor negotiations, but at this point there's no other alternative.